If I said I could show you how to get unlimited money in Steam, would you believe me? In today's video, we'll do precisely that. A large chunk of these games with a value of what were bought on the Steam sales without having to add any additional funds. This method is all legit, and now is the time to get in if you can. Let's get steamy on the community market, and welcome to Team Pandori. Subscribe, seriously. So around six years ago, I was at the in-laws. I'd built them a new computer, and to test it, I had a round of CSGO. A new update had just been released for it, and at the end of the game, I had a case drop. And I sold this immediately for over $5 on the Steam market. This $5 turned into 50, and then 500. But what are these cases? They're basically an in-game item for CSGO that you can sell on the Steam market. For these to drop, you need to be in any CSGO game where you can gain EXP. But it's a roll of the die. You may get new drops, older drops, or none at all. Alternatively, you could sell cards or items from other games. Or you could kickstart the operation with a little cash. So once we have some Steam credits, we'll check the community market. From here, scroll down, and on the right, we're going to push Counter-Strike Global Blah Blah Blah. We'll use this filter on the right, click it, and type in Case. Once they're filtered, we'll sort by price. Now that the cheapest cases are at the top, we can kind of visualize what's going on here. The case with the most supply is the cheapest. Let's check the Phoenix Weapon Case. If we scroll down, we can see the graph, and then press on Lifetime. When they first started dropping, it was very expensive, then it quickly became worthless. You couldn't give them away. But from a price of 4 yen, all the way to 500, it's a big difference. So these two cases I was very fond of, and I bought many for under 20 yen, which is like 15 cents. If you'd have bought some at 20, let's see how much profit would you got back. So the chunk at the end is around 10.44, which works out at flipping egg. Now let's check the blue one. If you notice, it's not going down, they're all going up. So this one at the peak is 1437, which works out at... So yes, the idea is investing in cases. Here's what to look out for. A low price. Much like penny stocks, if you grab a case at 10 cents, it's much easier to get a quick return. Low quantity. A rare item will naturally become more valuable. At the moment, the snakebite case is the cheapest at 54 yen. It'll be easier to make a higher return than the others, but as these are not exactly rare, it may take a while to do so. Scrolling down, we have a few options. By checking the quantity in relation to the price, we can quickly pinpoint the ones to grab. Recoil does look promising, but if you look at further down, the Prisma case, yeah, this is a good one to grab. Another one that catches my eyes is the CS20 case. It's a low quantity and quite cheap. And the price of this shadow case here is gonna skyrocket very soon. So a big question is when should you buy? Well, when it's cheap, either when the market is flooded by the item, or when there's a Steam sale. Many usually want to cash in when the sales are on to grab new games or a lovely Steam Deck. By looking at the graphs, we can see the prices go down at the time the Steam sale hits, and this year it started on June 29th. Right now the revolver case here is at 270, but it came all the way down from 340 just for the Steam sale. We can already see it's trying to creep its way back up. Enough talking, let's buy a case. I've decided on the Shadow case. The cheapest price at the moment is 135, but we can put in a cheaper order. So we can actually name our price and how many we want to buy. We can lower this to any price we like, but there's a chance it will never hit. If you need a punching bag, I can lend you Wesley. So I think maybe four of these at 126. Sounds reasonable. Once I'm happy, press place order. After waiting a bit, the cases will be added to your inventory. It may take months or even years for the cases to hit a good price, but once they do, you can sell up and repeat the process. Eventually, you'll be buying 50 cases at a time, as well as tons of games on the side. And with these assets moving on to Counter-Strike 2, we'll be good to profit for a long time indeed. This has been Amy Chicken of Team Pandori, and I'll catch you on the next one. Ta-ra! If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and bell. If you want a massage, just yell out for John Loot. Why not check another one of our videos?